Hello everyone, so I'm here to make my no makeup look. Uh, I've seen this video going around Twitter, uh, Twitter, <laughs> YouTube um, for quite a while now and I thought it would be a cool idea to, you know, to recreate it, to make my version of it. Um, this is ideal for, you know, those days that you gotta go somewhere, you gotta, or leave the house, whatever, and you don't feel like really putting all, a lot of makeup on or you know, doing a full, full makeup. Um, so this is a cool idea if you are running, you know, you're kind of short on time, uh, or you just don't wanna, don't feel like wearing a lot of makeup that day, or you just wanna look natural. Uh, this is a good alternative, for, uh, a good option for those kind of days. So if you wanna see how I achieve this look, then keep on watching. Alrighty guys, so let's get this no makeup look um, started. I'm going to show you what I'm going to be using here. First of all, I'm going to apply my primer. Same as always, a Rimmel Fix and Perfect. Number 2, 002. So I'm going to start applying that real quick. I have my mirror here. Yeah, this this makeup look is ideal you know when when you're running late um and you don't have time to do you know a full makeup but you want to look somehow decent <laughs> this look is good for that for foundation i'm still using the ready set gorgeous by um cover girl number 115 okay so i'm gonna use my this is not a beauty blender this is kind of like a fake one <laughs> but um it's not as good as a beauty blender but it's, it does its it job so i don't know last time i was on sephora i just didn't feel like spending you know 20 dollars for that i hope you can see what I'm doing I'm just applying the foundation all over as usual and I'm gonna put some more I feel that in order to get a good coverage with this foundation you need to use to apply like two coats you know only one yeah, it's, it's not gonna cover all your imperfections <laughs> so oops I don't wanna get anything in my hair it's funny because I bought that thing too to keep my hair like you know back so it doesn't get in my on my face when I'm doing my makeup and I use it a couple of times and that was it <laughs> now for a concealer I'm gonna be using the instant age rewind eraser dark circles by a Maybelline I've been using this stuff forever now and I love it so the only thing is next time I get it I'm gonna buy one shade darker because I think this is too light so I feel I need one shade a little bit darker this is too light so I think I used to have it in nude and this is like neutralizer it's called it's like yeah. All right. Now, um, I was gonna apply some bronzer on my cheeks. Oh, you know what? I forgot to get the um, blush. Oh my god, guys. Well, you, I would put some blush or either blush or bronzer on on the cheeks. I just didn't get it now and I don't know I just want to get done with these guys I'm kind of in a hurry right now um, but yeah you know that would be a 
good idea to, to give you some color. I'm just realizing now that I look at myself and I see so myself so pale. I'm like, I forgot the blush. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, let's keep going. But you know, uh, just remember to to add that when you do it. Um, and I have the Urban Decay Eye Primer. You know, the original one is the one I always use. Um, another product that I've been using for years now. And I love it. I'm gonna apply that on my eyelids. I gotta find a way, I gotta start playing more with my editing software. Well, I mean, I don't have a, I don't have any fancy editing software, of course, as you, you might, you can tell, but, um, yeah, I just use a Windows Movie Maker, but I thought it would be cool to start kind of playing, you know, put music in the background and maybe fast forward it a little bit so it's, so it doesn't take, you know, too long. Um, now for eyeshadow, I'm going to use these ones, but since this is the no makeup look, I'm not going to use the one for the crease, this dark one, I'm not going to use that. I'm just going to use the one in the bottom here for the, the lid and this one for the brow one, okay? So I'm going to apply some of that. It's a very, very natural look, like almost if you had no makeup on, so... We're trying to keep it as natural as possible. Very, very natural. All right. And now, um, just with my finger, I'm going to apply the lighter one, the top one all under my brows to highlight a little bit like that uh, I'm gonna be using mascara it's time for me to get some new mascara um, I went to the eye, well when I went to the eye doctor the other day she told me that I'm supposed to change my mascaras like she said once once a year, I'm going to be honest with you guys, I have some mascaras that I, they are over a year older. Um, <laughs> no, no good. So, um, yeah. And then somewhere else I read that you're supposed to actually change it every three months, which I was like, what? <laughs> oh, as you notice, I'm not going to use eyeliner today. Because again, we want this look to be as natural as possible, so I am not wearing, um, I'm not gonna wear any eyeliner. Okay, it feels really weird, right, to do makeup without eyeliner, but I thought it would make sense since we are kind of like pretending to look that we don't have makeup on <laughs> this look, but we actually do. Very subtle, but we do. Now, if I have to choose between using liner or um, mascara, I prefer using mascara. Like, I, I, I don't think it will be makeup without this. Uh, I need the one from L'Oreal, uh, Shocking Extensions. That one right there. Um, yep. And I'm going to do my brows a little bit with my Anastasia Beverly Hills, you know, chocolate um, brow shell, but very... Like slightly. I mean, I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna define them too much because we're trying to to get a natural look. So I'm just gonna do it, you know, just a tiny, tiny bit to give a tiny bit of color, but very light, very subtle, as you can see. My lips. Uh, I'm gonna use this Buxton. Um, Pumpling, pumpling, yeah. Lip gloss, um, this one right here that, you know, the color, the name is Leslie, just like myself. <laughs> so I'm gonna apply that. Mm -hmm. 
I love this uh, tingling sensation that this gloss has. It's not a lot because I don't like it when it's like a lot, but it has some. Alright. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna just let my hair down. Yeah, see, it almost looks like I had no makeup. But I still look better than, you know, when I started the video, right? <laughs> yeah. So I hope you like this no makeup look. Sorry for looking too much on the visor of the camera. I don't know. I've been doing a lot that a lot today I'm um, sorry about that but yeah I hope you like this no makeup uh, look it's so yeah guys I hope you like my video and I hope you have a great rest of the week thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and I'm gonna leave all my links down below you know my Instagram my Twitter and my Facebook page so make sure you follow me there as well um, yeah and that's all I have to say so have a great rest of the week and I see you in my next one Bye.